We've got more brand new lore. This time, it's all with Vashtor taking on the Tau. He launches his first official assault against the Tau faction, bringing death and destruction to a planet, all in search for this mysterious device that he's been searching for since the end of 9th edition. So let's jump in and let's get waffling. Now, since this is a short story taken from the brand new Chaos Codex, I have to give a spoiler warning. If you haven't read it, and if you want to read it and don't want to be spoiled, then please leave the video right now. This is your first and only warning so the story opens up with the wormwood that's passing through like warp barriers through the very immaterium through like the webway itself to get to the destination and it slowly emerges back into reality over this tau planet this is where vashtor then is ripped from the warp and he starts to emerge himself actually on the planet right at the edge of like this huge tau city that is on fire it's ruined it's been attacked by none other than the black legion itself now vashtor himself was summoned to this planet because he looks around and he sees like this summoning circle he sees the battle in front of him which is complete mayhem you've got like tau flyers being chased by hell drakes explosions black legionnaires are just gunning down tau in trenches the tower doing their best to defend the this city the main thing that they are defending is this like temple structure in the center which is kind of the prize for the black legion and vashtor himself but one of the really cool things about this since the wormwood has arrived in system bringing vashtor to it it's kind of like the death star like you look up and it's slowly eclipsing the sun like the very light of the planet is being blocked out by the wormwood itself now one of the sorcerers that summoned vashtor begins to tell him that even though the planet looks like it's in ruin and the tau forces are being slaughtered it's absolutely the opposite the tau are actually holding their ground the black legion are paying costly in terms of bodies cultists demon engines to try and take this city and breach to that sacred temple that vashtor wants to get to now vashtor seeing this more or less like laughs and smirks and says i can care not once the wormwood aligns above the planet destruction victory will be ours and that's what happens you have this scene where like the wormwood comes across the planet and because like the gravitational pull on it it literally begins to rock the planet and you get these like massive earthquakes that split the ground start swallowing like up tired chunks of the city vast amount of tau forces are like just lost in like voids of like endless craters and stuff like that the wormwood itself is literally winning the war on this planet now with this the tau forces start to withdraw disorderly which the black legionnaires pounce upon slaughtering countless tau forces and ripping them apart vashtor then starts to walk towards this temple structure like his followers start to see him they start to go inside saying like oh this vashtor's arrived the cult is like going to like a blood frenzy they just start launching themselves at like the tau guns and stuff completely overwhelming the factions and start just ripping them apart and everything like that and vashtor then more or less gets towards the temple and he sees an, a big reinforcement of even more tau forces and he's like these these whelps and stuff like that i'll have to handle them and like this big like um demonic engine comes onto the battlefield to assist him and vashtor looks at it and basically empowers it with his demonic vashtor powers and it gives it like you know extra armor more strength more firepower just more devastating stuff on the battlefield and that charges these tau forces and begins to rip them apart we get this absolutely amazing scene then when vashtor is walking through the battle as it's all around him like the tau themselves are bringing down reinforcements from the heavens they don't want the black legion or vashtor and his forces to reach this temple you've got like a bunch of um uh, tau behind like a force field that they have and vashtor points like one of his crooked knife fingers towards it and the energy in that force field turns against them and begins burning them alive like if you've got any type of technology do not try and use it on vashtor he will turn against you and make you die with that very uh, very same thing like he's walking through the battlefield and with his massive demon hammer he's just knocking things aside like tanks and battle suits and stuff like that this is really cool scene where an actual battle suit 
comes down and drops right in front of him and it's like kind of like gandalf like you shall not pass but what happens is that he just looks at it and he turns the suit against like the tau guy inside of it and it literally just kills him from like within it's just like oh my god this is an absolute horrible way to die if you've got any type of technology do not try and use it against vashtor because it'll turn it against you whatever's inside this temple vashtor can feel its power it's some type of relic the story doesn't go into detail to explain what that relic is the story doesn't go into detail like where this planet actually is we don't know where it is within the tau empire it could not be in the tau empire it could be in the sphere sphere expansion with the tau stuff that's going on nothing is really made clear the only thing that we do know is that vashtor has brought his army against the tau empire and he's destroying this planet to try and get the relic the story ends on a really cool line i'm going to read it right from the book here he says he was being a limitless patient he would find the lock and reality would tremble before him so it's still on that quest for the lock this relic has to be a part of that lock quest so he can unlock whatever he wants to unlock and bring death and destruction to the imperium to the galaxy ascend to demonhood as he's always wanted to do since he started this conquest in ninth edition now one of the main questions i have from this is when does this take place we know vashto right now is in the pariah nexus that is what's happening in the current narrative in warmer 40,000. he's there with the necrons with the silent king um i think gilliman's about to be there again hopefully the lions are going to be there we got a, this full shebang to that i'm probably going to say that this maybe happens after it because we haven't had vashtor fight the tower mention fighting the tower anywhere else but this story so maybe this is a part of one of the next big narrative campaigns that they're going to explore in another book series that's what i'm going to say at this moment in time i'm probably wrong it probably happens before it but that's where my head is right now anyway chaprunios thank you for coming thank you for watching again um, if i get any more new lore and stuff like that i'll try my best to uh, make videos of it i do want to cover some more stuff on um huron and stuff like that in this chaos codex because i think there is a few new spicy things in there which again could lead to the so-called rumors of huron getting a brand new model and hopefully red corsairs getting some love as well but again that's got to be some time um next week um, if you've got any thoughts feedback anything like that at all post it down below and i'll do my best to try and respond and um, fill you in with some of the void uh, blanks in there the story is really really good i really did enjoy it there's a lot of stuff that i missed in there you know some of the like the amazing battle scenes and stuff like that but mostly it is just vashtor bringing death and destruction to the tau empire see you in a bit have a great night day evening wherever you are in the world and bye bye